To make our application, we must choose new file and select project. We check that the basic visual option is selected, which is located on the right side in the box and installed. We choose Windows for application. We put in the box of name. We delete the previous text, which had the title of Windows App 3, and we choose a new name. We will call client this application. We examine the location of our project. Then we select with a click accept and this sends us a screen that says from design. In this window we are going to create our interface. For that we go to the toolbox. In the toolbox, we select button and configure its naming properties. We must select the button to modify it. In properties, we look for the text option. We erase the previous name and we write the, name, the new name. In this case, it will be connect. Now, we adapt the position in which we want it. Then, we select a label. We arrange in the place that we want and in the same way that we configure the button. In properties, we look for the text option and modify it. Below is the interface that is already finished. The design that we choose according to the instruction of the practice is shown. To show the code, we select the tab that say client socket it will take use to the class that we created previously. In the first part of the code, we can see the libraries that are the imports. This select code shows how to descend and recite the messages. The complete code is divided into sections and commented. The producers for making the connection to the server. The producer for connection to the server. For this connection, the server to abort the thread. Finally, the code is observed to send messages to the server. All code for the form is a bit simple and describes all the variables just in design. TXT port for the text, MBAT for buttons and ETC. We show the tabs in the application where you see the design, the class and the form. We show once again to the complete code for the form. To design the client application, we perform the same products just to perform the server interface in the same way that the cuts are introduced. Before starting the application, the code must be compiled to observe this correct in both application.
To run the application, we must click on Start in Bot Cut. Wait for it to load. The load, the, the load time depends on your computer, can be faster or slower. And the end of the load is shown to the server executable and the client we accommodate the screens to see both applications. To use the application, we must choose the per bot. It could be mentioned that the per must be equal in both application so that it can communicate we must also use the fixes IP. We place it a hundred to twenty seven point zero point zero point one. We click on listen and the select connect send use message that have established a connection in both sides. So now we process to write a message. In this case we will write message Hello, how are you? And we send the everyone from the server application in this client application should you shall see the message. During the realization and the practice we had some small errors. So you can see that the message arrived into lower text box box in taste of upper one. We process to answer the message into same why as uh, on a server, not that the message can be seen in the server application. In this way, we corroborate that the practice were work. This way our practice was done, the video had to be cut a bit since it could be very long. 